Everybody quite ready? Mr. President, our brief ceremonies will consist in the blast, showing you our method. Silence, please. Showing you our method of removing the major part of the rock. Immediately following this will be the unveiling of the head of Thomas Jefferson. Immediately following that will be the lifting of foreign flags. We are showing here the flag of the Bourbons, the Spanish and the tricolor of France when the American government took over the purchase of the Louisiana Territory. Following this will be the hoisting of the Jefferson flag. The Jefferson flag is the brother, I like to call him my brother, my son who is in charge of the work on the mountain, Mary That shot was fired just above what will finally be Jefferson's hand. friends that there were two people who told me about this in the early days. One of them, Mr. Borglum, and the other, Senator Norbeck. <laughs> you know, on many occasions, when a new project is presented to you on paper, of the democratic republican form of government, not only in our own beloved country, but we hope throughout the world. <laughs> this is the second dedication. And there will be others by other presidents in other years. And when we get through, there will be something for the American people that will last through not just generations, but thousands and thousands of years. And I think that we can perhaps meditate a little on those Americans 10,000 years from now when the weathering of the face of Washington and Jefferson and Lincoln shall have proceeded to a depth of perhaps a tenth of an inch. 10,000 years from now, I think we can meditate and wonder whether our descendants, because I think they'll still be here, what they will think about us. And let us hope that at least they will give us the benefit of the doubt that they will believe that we have honestly striven in our day and generation to preserve for our descendants a decent land to live in and a decent form of government to operate under. 
And so I'm very glad to have come here today, informally, as is very right and proper. Because we don't want formalities where nature is concerned. And what we have done so far exemplifies what I've been talking about in the last few days. Cooperation with nature and not fighting with nature. Happen in the future at Mount Rushmore. Materials of artists, numbers, granite, glass, 